Hey everyone and welcome to Dark Sun Gaming. My name is Chris and in today's video we are taking a look at my super physical team when I took on Extreme Super Battle Road against the Extreme Intelligence team or the enemies. So in this one this was kind of straightforward with it. Obviously went ahead and ran with the new uh, Super Saiyan 2 Angel Fujita as my lead and actually as double leads and then this guy right here was kind of like the MVP on it uh, as one of the partners for that uh, uh, Fujita, uh, LR Fujita, just because of the fact that he is able to one, not only boost his own defense, but then turn around and raise key of all uh, allies by three and then also defense by 30%, and then Super Saiyan 2 category allies get an additional 30% attack. And then he also is there to meet the passive ability for the unit super attack with Fujita. So obviously very good for that to be able to work out that way. And then uh, next, uh, obviously turning around for not only great defense, great attack, and then that ability to be able to randomly heal full power uh, if you make it to turn five, uh, great on that aspect of it. And then uh, Android 17, MVP 17, uh, very good again, not only lowering attack and defense, but then also there for the three key support and then defense plus 60%, not to mention he does reduce damage by 40% when HP is below 77. And then obviously, uh, Super Saiyan Blue Fujito there for the counters and uh, his uh, damage reduction, so very clutch there. And then I went ahead and took the 50% Gohan uh, support lead in there. So that's pretty much the team build. Ran pretty well. I believe I beat it on my second attempt. Uh, I think I had gotten uh, kind of messed up at another point uh, and then had to go back through. So uh, that's pretty much it. So uh, we'll go ahead and end this preview and jump right into the gameplay. Alright everybody, and here we are going up against the Extreme Intelligence enemies on Extreme Super Battle Road and uh, just kind of going through and figuring out exactly how I want to get this situated first. As you can see here, I've got uh, Angel uh, Fujita and MVP 17 and then also the Gohan. I'm going to uh, end up, I believe, keeping the Gohan on the third slot, uh, hoping that everything should be able to balance through with uh, enough defense but I don't think I'm going to be able to get it so I do end up using an Icarus here just to ensure that uh, again I'm not going to die I mean I've got some pretty decent uh, health with 424,000 health um, but again focusing everything on Raditz going to hit him as hard as I possibly can and uh, I mean this is <laughs> 1.8 million <laughs> half of it I, that that Vegeta is great I mean and then taking double digits uh normals is obviously fabulous um having um the boost from android uh 17 mvp 17 then also um mystic gohan here it, it definitely makes it a lot better um getting his stun off and so many times on these you do kind of have to rely on rng and you have to sit back and and when you're going to be doing something sometimes say hey i'm i'm gonna hope that something's gonna actually trigger off um, but otherwise, you're you're just kind of hitting through and, and hoping everything's gonna gonna work out right. Uh, so with Raditz done, we're gonna jump right up against Nappa. We know we don't have to worry about uh, Fujita because he's stunned. And uh, again, the, one of the rotations I most definitely want to have is going to be the uh, Super Saiyan 2 Goku. And oh yeah, right there, get the double super attack, um, 1.8 mil for the first one, and the second one here is gonna come across at 1.1 mil. Uh, 18 key versus 12 key and then uh, you know then then you get 1.4 off of the uh, Goku and Vegeta fusion into uh, Gogeta and uh, here let's see let's uh, 737,000 um, let's see here that right there's about our 250 so we're almost at about a million uh, with him with another super so a million seven uh, is what he's doing and then this is right here just great I mean look at look at the way I'm uh, almost instantly at an 18 key so I'm gonna hit him uh, Fujita and probably kill him here uh, with these this is the reason why you want to make sure that you have uh, Super Saiyan 2 Goku uh, with this Vegeta because he is part of that Majin Buu saga he's a Goku character he's gonna be triggering that special attack and uh, then this is just, I mean, animations are nice. I mean, I, I really didn't get a chance to, to play around with them much before going into this. 
uh, but right there, 2.5 crit, and that's that. So uh, we just move right along, and this was probably one of the easier ones that I was able to go through and do. Um, I'm so indifferent. I like the fact that on uh, stage five, or, or the, the five enemies, it's so nice to be able to have them uh, at lower health. Uh, you're able to attack people, but I, you're always just trying to figure out, okay, how do I want to get it set up? Um, I did want to try to make sure that I'm getting um, the, the Gohan here and just to try to make sure I'm getting my orb changes. Uh, do throw a Whis because with those five attacks coming through, it, it's just difficult. And, and I want to make sure here that I'm able to turn around and I think I end up going for that uh, rainbow orb with the green uh, to uh, get everything situated from here. But going after Goldo, um, yeah, that's what I ended up doing. And then again, just trying to attack the weakest link Goldo, um, going right from the back on through. Now here I did want to try to uh, ensure that I can get a, as low as I possibly could on uh, Birder. Um, but otherwise, Actually, the reason why I attacked Gohan, or excuse me, Ginyu with Gohan, was because I was hoping for that stun. Um, so again, just you know, you're taking thirty-five thousand for even with the least active. That's 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 saying something. But otherwise, uh, two point five mil, he should be dead, and that's the reason why I did end up selecting uh, go uh, the the physical Gogeta uh, to be able to go after Birder because I really wanted to make sure that I was going to be hitting somebody else. So here. Again, yeah, just amazing um, team ups. I can't remember if I end up going straight on to uh, Jace or not. But yeah, okay, so I pick up on Jace and uh, uh, probably gonna kill him out. Then go ahead and finish off Birder with uh, Goku. And I think I continue to have, to have the attack, you know, go against Birder just to guarantee because there's no reason why Jace should still survive after this hit. Um, but otherwise, you know, you're, you're still getting five-digit uh, normals, uh, low five-digit. And here we go, hitting up for 1.4, no, 2 million. Uh, so, I did not kill Jace there. Yeah, but double super attack, hey, pretty clutch there. Finish him off, going to get hit pretty hard here. Yeah, I got almost 100,000 on that. But I should be fine, and actually, uh, no, I wouldn't trigger it because I'm only on, <laughs> almost got everybody killed off when we're on turn two. Um, so it's uh, it's a little bit different there, but uh, here I think I end up blocking through because I'm able, I'm not too worried about Ginyu uh, being able to, to kind of take him off here, making sure that my uh, damage reduction with uh, MVP 17 is, is going to come in fine there, going to heal up enough uh, to and, and uh, attack uh, Raccoon, uh, make sure Raccoon gets uh, wiped out by uh, Super Saiyan 2, uh, Angel Fujita, and then Gohan obviously going through to, to make sure I finish him off. Probably should have ended up going with either on that uh, Goku, or excuse me, with that Gohan, probably should have went after Ginyu or uh, Jace since they're the ones that are attacking me afterwards, but uh, MVP 17 is very, very strong, and I think he actually ended up killing Ginyu there. We'll know here in a moment, but yeah, Raccoon should be gone. Uh, here, once Gohan ends up taking him out, uh, so you're getting pretty... Oh, he doesn't die. No, I thought he died. But yeah, uh, MVP 17 did take out uh, Ginyu, uh, and we're going to be set here to be able to just get the uh, special uh, active skill, which is just... Man, that just looks so cool there. <laughs> that was such a cool part in the anime. Uh, you are number one. So from here, I know I'm going to pretty much be able to wipe out anybody. Not really going to be worried about getting hit. So from here, I should easily be able to take out Raccoon and then be able to uh, tank that uh, attack from, from Jace. And I'm, I'm not worried about anything. Uh, but I actually did end up selecting Jace there. I don't know why I would have done that. Again, just probably not thinking when I was going through. Probably should have gone for a Raccoon um, just to make sure everything was going to be fine there. But, uh, I mean, th this is going to be the last turn. I mean, they, these guys should not survive uh, going through and getting hit with anything. But um, if you're able to get that that friend, um, at least for the uh, Angel Fujita, LR Angel Fujita, uh, you should be good and, you know, have somebody that's... Uh, 
you know, if, if you're we were lucky enough to pull the uh, fusions, uh, that should actually help you out quite a bit. Or if you can, uh, pretty much any 120 lead. I mean, as long as you got one Vegeta and, and that. A Goku combo, you're going to be pretty well set. But here I go ahead and heal up. And, and again, kind of what I said, it was really nice to be able to have five enemies uh, because you know you're going to have pretty low health you're going to get through it. Uh, you know, knock them off pretty quick. But you have to be careful because, you know, you're getting attacked a lot more. I mean, yeah, they're not as powerful, but you're just continuously. I mean, these guys can still, you know, knock you on your butt if you're not careful. Um, but here I think I do end up having... Uh, try to get as much of... Uh, Vegito's passive ability to be able to kind of go off. I know I'm getting the extra defense uh, thanks to MVP 17. I still am able to get the, at least the 18 key off and try to knock out Turles because Turles is hitting the most as far as the, uh, the amount of times he's attacking. But I do also want to make sure I'm protecting uh, MVP 17 by going against uh, I don't even know what that dude's name is. Uh, but yeah, here got 3.4 uh, crit. Uh, going through, hitting for about 230. <laughs> so, what are we at now? That total be about 750. That's about 1.5 million. Um, there's 175. Got the extra one. But yeah, he's he's disgusting. But yeah, here trying to make sure I'm I'm getting rid of Turles. And what do I end up taking this for? 77,000. I mean, that's not bad. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely low. I was definitely a little bit worried here. Um, hoping that. Uh, but then again, with uh, 17's ability to not only hit very hard, but also uh, lower attack and defense with his super, I mean, you're good to go. You don't have much to worry about. I do think that I end up doing a heal here. Um, Don't I? If I, I probably probably should seventy nine thousand. <laughs> it's been so long since I've actually done this road. Um, trying to make sure I'm, I'm finding time to. Uh, sometimes when I'm doing the super battle roads, I obviously am taping everything, and then it's in between, you know, whenever I've got free time to say, hey, I've got 15, 20 minutes to try to take out a level, and then uh, go back over it uh, once I have a chance to look at it. But uh, you know, for the most part, it's uh, just trying to. to get everything situated and I think what I'm trying to do here is kind of spread the wealth a little bit on the attacks because I'm pretty confident I'm going to end up getting my uh, Dokkan attack uh, sooner rather than later on this and just don't want to uh, get nailed but yeah I think I do end up taking an Aider just to make sure because what what we're at 79,000 so I mean if I hit if I get anything close to 79,000 then double digit comp what does he hit me for yeah, 161, so yeah, with, without that Aider, I'd have been dead. And um, definitely wouldn't have wanted that. But um, we're just trying to go through, get everything 2.6 million, uh, finish off Turles. And then from here, it's pretty much easy. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, but still, I mean, that, I mean, that right there is another 100,000 for that hit. I did put full additional in for him because uh, obviously being able to, to get that 20 additional. Um, typically on support characters, all support characters, the way I build them personally is I they are there for support. They are, they are not there to hit people. They are not there to um, kill people. The only time that I may give them additionals is if they have another uh, kit such as lower attack or stun. Otherwise, I give full dodge. Um, that's just personally the way I like to build. Uh, just to make sure that I'm going to be perfectly fine with, with any types of builds or anything going on from that standpoint. Because the, the worst thing you want to do is being reliant on somebody. Yeah, you could add some crit or you could add additionals to try to boost it up. But it's so much more beneficial if they're just not getting hit. Especially, I actually love, I've got Candy Fujito, which I, I, I have my fingers crossed. Um, I think the, the current event, the Gohan stuff, the time of me uh, recording this, the Gohan was just announced and all the information for his uh, the, the celebration, uh, the autumn training celebration was up and going and um, it ends like October 28th, I think, is when the uh, that, that goes through and gets situated. But anyway, I really, really think 
we could get an easy A for that Candy Fujito, and I, I hope that happens, because that Candy Fujito, I made mine with so much dodge, it's ridiculous, and I, if you guys uh, saw on my um, uh, uh, tech, uh, super tech team uh, on my Super Battle Road, I mean, that, I, mean I, I planned on not getting hit. I mean, even when I got hit, yes, I was getting hit for like 99,000, but considering the fact that he would dodge like seven other times, <laughs> you know that's fine. Um, so, yep, able to wipe out this level pretty good on that standpoint. No problems, ready to go. Hitting it up, going up against Cell, and the best part was is I was able to hold off the Dokkan attack, so I think I actually Dokkan uh, with uh, Vegeta and <laughs> really mess him up, and I, I just did not want to just get full power, get Princess Snake, don't, on, I'm not running for no item runs or anything on these. I just wanted to get them built the first time and not have to worry about it. But uh, I'm pretty confident here. This is a, uh, a GG on this. But otherwise, um, oh, I'm trying to find the uh, information on the, the new training autumn, autumn training. I'm pretty confident it's the 28th. And, and last year we got the um, uh, uh, Gotinks and the uh, Boos, and that was, I mean, they're a good unit. I mean, at the end of the day, either one of them could actually turn around and end up getting an easy A. Anybody that has like a candy eating ability, I think could end up turning around and getting an easy A and uh, just kind of really getting situated from that standpoint. So um, yeah, the information I don't, don't have right now, but I'm pretty sure it's 28. So. Uh, very realistic we could end up with just a very small Halloween celebration and maybe get a really cool easy a out of that and uh, Yeah, so right there kind of wiping everybody out <laughs> Not having a problem taking everything from this standpoint as MVP 17 so many times does is going to wipe out cell here And he's dead so that's it. I am all done with this level that is it Thank you guys very much for watching. If you haven't done so already, please make sure you're hitting that red subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you're notified every single time I'm uploading a new video. Also, let me know down in the comments how your Extreme Super Battle Road runs are going. And um, otherwise, that's it. Thank you guys very much. And uh, we'll talk to you guys later.